Hey, this is Alex Power, and in today's tutorial, I will teach you how to create a sniper scope effect in Adobe Premiere Pro CC 2017. Let's get started. I purposely put two separate clips on the timeline. I have first clip of the person that is holding sniper rifle, and the second clip is where is the actual scope's going to be introduced. So we'll just put them side by side you can just go to google images and look for sniper rifle scope green screen i don't recommend you to get the highest resolution ones just get the ones that are a little washed out see it's even smaller than we need i'm just gonna go to the effect controls and i will scale this to the size that we're looking for approximately right here somewhere there's lots of different options out there so uh, you can find this pretty easily let's just zoom in and put this rifle scope green screen right on top of our footage now we need to scale this even a little more and let's extend this to the length of the clip go to the effects and look for ultra key grab that ultra key right on top of that green screen layer we'll grab this little tool here and just key that in you can leave this as is it looks okay I actually like to change a few settings first thing I'm gonna go to the blend mode and change it from normal to subtract and now I'm gonna change the output from composite to alpha channel and that way we have some of the footage playing kind of on the background but that's darkened now it looks all good but I want actually to zoom in when the thief reaching for the purse right here so I want to zoom in on his face I will create at this point a couple of keyframes for position and for scale on the lower clip remember not the top green screen clip but the lower clip and I will go up to the point when he's there and I wanted to change the scale somewhere around here and I want to change the position that his face will be right at the middle of the scalp right there and now towards the end now right here I wanted to zoom out so I'll just copy this four keyframes and I will paste them here I'll switch them around I'll just move them right around here it's good and I'll move them apart a little bit longer let's play this back and watch how is the sniper scope in Adobe Premiere works and this is how you create a sniper scope effect in Adobe Premiere Pro CC 2017 thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe like drop a comment and press this bell notification button that you won't miss any of the future videos that I release on this channel. See you next time.